My favorite one, though, that is weird, which is one of the most controversial ads of that time. Oh, look at this one. This one's from Gauntlet Dark Legacy. The game where you and three buddies all get to be heroes. Only thing is one of you has to be the chick because it's like a four-player gauntlet game and one of them's a woman. Can you imagine that today? That today. My favorite one is this one, though. This one is bizarre to me. This is a Game Boy ad. So this is, this is Nintendo, my friends. So it's an attractive woman wearing some kind of uh, lingerie and she's tied to a bed. Uh, and there's a guy in the foreground uh, playing his Game Boy. And the, the, the tag is, the new Game Boy Pocket, seriously distracting. What's great about this is I think what they're going for is similar to this ad. Uh, another Sega ad. I remember when he couldn't keep his hands off me. So it's like, here's this sexy lady, but he would, better, he would rather be playing video games, right? I think they're trying to do that. But this lady looks like a prisoner in a, like a hostage movie. She's tied to a bed. There's no sheets on the bed. It's just a mattress. This, I don't think this is sending the message that they think it is. I've always been like, is this supposed to be attractive? She looks like she's about to be murdered. I don't understand this. People are saying I'm kink shaming. I'm not kink shaming. I'm not kink shaming anyone who's into BDSM or Fifty Shades of Grey or anything like that. This doesn't look like that. This looks like a woman's been taken against her will at the bus stop, brought back to a serial killer's house, and put on a bed that ain't in, in, in a room like in the back room of some little fucking house. And she's about, to, he's, she's about to get killed. That's all I'm saying. That's not kink shaming. Yeah, she looks like she was kidnapped. She doesn't look like she's there. I mean, look at her. I, get her. I guess her face is meant to be like, oh, why won't you play with me and not your Game Boy? But it looks, especially given that he's not even in the room, this is clearly shot before then. And this is like a, a, a demarcation between the, the photo work done and the product shot. She's not, she's not even looking at the guy playing the game. Look where her eyeline goes. Someone's over there. He's not even in the room. Come on now. 